guys and welcome to another video. Today we are at the track with my E36 M3 convertible and I'm super super excited. I have been on a, like a track day once before but that was on like a really very slippery track and today it's actually a proper race track so this will be super Listen to that, so cool. I have got my drifting spare in the steering wheel back on the car, and now it's finally road legal again, so that's really, really nice. Before we begin, remember to subscribe and like the video, and now, let's simply have a good day. actually starting to rain a little bit now so I think I'm going out with the wheels I have on the car because it's not going to wear that much but now we are ready for the technical inspection but I mean it got seriously MOT last week so if, not, if this will not pass the technical inspection I don't know what will I mean it's a daily so it's not a street track car but uh, yeah we're gonna use it like one actually a really funny thing is that now uh, the, the local track, which is called Gerenland Motor Center, which is in uh, Sheen, that has actually been upgraded. I think it's actually twice the length what it was earlier. For like 10 years or something, this track has been the same, so it's pretty cool to get that upgrade on the local track. So super, super excited to be testing the M3 on this new track. But uh, now let's get through inspection and then look at some other cars to see what the track looks like and how they drive it and uh, look at the cornering and stuff like that and the techniques, how other people do it. And uh, oh damn, it's pouring down now. But yeah. So uh, yeah, this is gonna be a good day. Okay. We got the car through inspection, that's very, very good. The only thing I needed to do was pull out a tow hook from the trunk, actually, and remove like the list right here. So we have that in case something goes wrong, but I hope it will not go wrong, of course. So now we're ready. Thank <laughs> you. 
here. two heats with the E36 M3. I feel like it's it was really wet on track, so I managed to do some drifting with it, but of course, I feel like the car is quite heavy, so it's it's actually a little bit hard to continue to have a continuous good drift all the way, as you probably also saw on the GoPro footage. But still, the car does not overheat. It's it works really really good, so I am really really happy about that. And now the sun is actually coming out here, so it is starting to get a lot better weather, and that's good. So the track is getting a little bit dry, so I'll go back out. But now I think I will have to really like throw the car into the corners and maybe do some clutch kicking to keep the car in drift. I don't know, but I'm really, really exciting. I'm having a really good day, so let's just continue having a good time. dry on track so I really really feel that I should have had if I were to take this drifting on a more professional level than this I would have had a lot stiffer suspension the suspension is not nearly stiff enough to throw the car around corners so yeah that kind of it not sucks it's still pretty cool but I feel like it's uh, the not per it's not the perfect arena here because it's so many like drift missiles and uh, people have like uh, hydro e brakes and bucket seats and I really feel like I'm getting thrown in the car in there so it's fun but yeah uh, <laughs> it should have been stiffer and better seats and all, all that it's really really cool to like I said have this as a summer cruiser and a daily and then be able to take it to tra on the track and have a lot of fun I'm not expecting it to be perfect on track like because it's not but it's still a lot Lot of fun so yeah best of both worlds I'm really happy or not best at both worlds best in one world and good in another world let's say that 
yeah, let's now go check out some cool cars and maybe get some a few ride-alongs as well. Adrenaline. This is so much fun. I mean, I can enjoy this on a hot summer day and I can take it to the track and have so much fun. I like that a lot. Now, the tires are kind of worn, as you see right there. So that's not good. So we have to swap to those. There we go. Now we got these wheels back on. I see they have a little bit of not too much air in them. And that will just quite fine and you see these yeah no good especially this one I mean look at this yeah we cannot use that on the way home so luckily I did not damage the new wheels so that's pretty good but we definitely need some new tires on these yeah it's been a good day and the car has survived that's the most important thing no damages here, the car has not been overheating or anything, engine is in perfect condition still, really good, I'm happy. Thank you guys for watching this video, I really hope you enjoyed it, I really enjoyed today, I was considering, considering not going, I don't know what I was thinking because clearly this is too much fun, it's so good, so uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, like I said, once more, hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next video, goodbye.